Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and I hope you're ready to get weird because today we're going to be checking out Scorn. Now, I'm super excited for this. I've been following this game for, I think, around six years now. It's been in development, and finally it has come out, and they actually sponsored this episode, so I do want to thank them for supporting the channel. If at any time during the video you want to learn more about the game, I'll have a link at the top of the video description where you can check it out. The game will be available on release on Xbox Series X and S and PC. Now, this game is heavily inspired by the works of H.R. Geiger, which is one of my favorite artists. He's kind of famous for blending human with machine. Uh, so, yeah, a lot of this world is a fleshy, mechanical world, and it's extremely creepy, but beautifully artistic. So we're going to get into it today, see what it's all about, and yeah, experience this horror together uh, as we are this weird human being, as you can see right here. <laughs> All right, well, here we are, free from the pits of, well, this whole world. And already, visually, I am so impressed with this. I don't honestly know what to expect in this game. Uh, I'm assuming we're going to have to deal with monsters and everything, but right now, it's looking like we're just going to deal with ourselves as we crawl around this whole weird world. I don't know if we're having, like, visions or if he's just exploring for that long. Uh, clearly... We're gonna have a problem right now, though. We've gone to the pits. All right, well, we survived that fall, and here we are in the first area. Um, yeah, quite grim right now. Uh, now, I do know that every area in this game is a certain theme, so they're all different themes, but they blend together. And we kind of explore this world by solving puzzles, so that's all I know right now. Uh, and that's all I really have at my disposal. I don't even know what that means, but I can't really do anything right now. I make a weird noise, though. You hear that? I don't know what that is. All right, already, this is extremely beautiful, but creepy. Like, look at the detail. I can see why this took six years. I, I At least I think it's six years. It might even be more than that to develop. I mean, they had to figure out a whole world that's kind of this mechanical yet skeleton-like design. I've never seen anything like this. Uh, okay. This game really just literally dropped me in. I don't know what I'm doing, but I, I'm enjoying exploring. All right, so it does look like there's, like, machines in here. I don't know what to call these because everything's flesh-like, but obviously it's mechanical as well. Again, H.R. Geiger, so a lot of inspiration from him already, and I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. I'm just going to continue forward. There's weird noises. I'm scared I'm going to be attacked or something. Oh, my God. This is... This is a world like no other, truly. Okay, we got some sort of crane thing. I don't know what the hell that noise was, but it sounded big. All right. Well, we have a door here. Oh, looks like it's not going to open. But I should be able to, yep, squeeze through. And almost kill myself right at the start. Great. All right. Well, we're definitely not going back that way. So at least I know I'm going the right direction because it's locked me in here. What the hell is this? Ew. What do I do with this? Okay. Oh. Uh. Is that an upgrade? I thought something attacked me in there. Oh my god. This is so gross. Okay. I have. <laughs> I have a pointy thing. Uh, I don't know what I can do at this point. Anything? Is this a vehicle? Like, <laughs> it's so hard to understand anything in this world because it's nothing like anything I've seen. So I just got to kind of explore and learn as we go. So I think my hands go here. Yeah, that's clearly a hand. Direction. Ooh. Okay, so I needed that for that. Ew. What am I doing? Direction use. Okay, so I can control the door, obviously. So, use. That's locked. Let's try this side. That unlocks something. And now we can use that gear. Oh my god, this is so gross and cool. Alright, sorry about dropping those things. I, how the hell do I get out of this? There we go. Oh, it's closing. Go, go, go! And I guess that was our first very basic puzzle. All right, getting some very weird noises. Look at this world. This is so eerie, but beautiful. Oh, okay. Well, we have a thing we can go up, clearly. Um, looking around. I don't want to fall into any of 
place. Everything creeps me out. All right, well, let's go up the creepy structure here. There's got to be something up here. Okay, and we have some sort of control system here. Uh, what the hell? Ooh. Okay, so that was like a top-down vision. How convenient. I don't know what I'm doing right now, but this is exciting. All right, so what happens if I use? Okay, so these move. Do I connect them all in a big circle, maybe? Because, yeah, I can control all three of these wires, whatever they are. I can't really explain what I'm doing in this game because nothing is, like, normal. Um, But, yeah, I did a big circle. Is that right? Or do we have to, like, power up different doorways with that? It sounds good. I, I, don't, I don't know what that sound is, but it's new. Can I use this now? Yes. Ew. Oh, God. Everything is just so weird. What is this? What the hell did I just do? What? Oh. I didn't even notice this thing up here, but I can use this now? What the hell? What am I doing? I'm I'm very confused by everything in this game. Now, if I use... Can I use this now? No. I brought this closer, but I don't know really what that's doing. God, even this looks like a human. All right, so this has to be a rail system. I thought I was moving cables, but yeah, this is definitely a rail system. So I've turned them all onto the exit points again. I guess I'm going to follow them and just see if there's any sort of cart or anything. Because if you remember that crane... Maybe I have to pick up something with that crane with the cart system? Alright, I have another control system. I'm not sure... Okay, so this can move... What does this do? Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Uh... Well, good thing I wasn't sitting there. So I wonder if I gotta, like, cut something up. Oh my god, there's just so many bodies everywhere. <laughs> I have so many different machines I can use. Can I use this? No. Oh. Oh, that actually opened? Oh, no, it's locked. Okay. So I found another machine. I just got to figure out how to unlock this. I wonder if I can do it on this side. Okay, so yeah, now that unlocks the locking mechanism. So I should be able to... Wait. So I... Do I need a friend? Because if I have this, if I have someone on this, I can use this to open it. I don't think I'll be able to open it right now. Yeah, because they reset. Huh. Well, if I find a friend, I know how to do this. What the hell is this? Oh. Oh. Uh, oh, no. Oh, where am I going? Oh, I'm just using things. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I don't like that I'm going up. There's a whole other level. Okay, well, there's a rail system. I don't know if this is a rail system or not. I'm wondering if I gotta find something up here to bring down to the pits of hell. Oh my god. Okay. Hello? Can I just figure this out, please? <laughs> there's so many things I can use. What does this do? Oh. Oh. That looks like a seat. What the frig? What, a what is that? Grab it. Oh, I can't grab it. Oh, wait, I can grab these. Oh, <gasps> this is a puzzle. This is a, there's pieces. This is gross. All right, so what if I put a piece right on that light? I don't, I, th I thought this, I, I had to like connect four or something. Like this was a sick game of connect four. <laughs> but it might be that easy. Just put a little piece of meat wad on the light where it grabs. And are we good? No. You don't, you don't like that one? God damn it. I, I was hoping it'd be easy. Only other thing I can think of is there's these two pieces that have a glow to them. I, that might just be the light, though. Uh, but yeah, it looks like this guy has a glow. So I'm wondering if I need to... I can't move it. Hmm. Well, I can move this one that has the lights. But I can't move this one. Okay, I understand why I can't move that one. Because it needs to be these little... Uh, holder, like, sucker cup areas. Uh, there's not a sucker cup right where my claw is right now. So I gotta move this guy up. And... Oh, God. I suck at puzzles! Alright, so if we move this over, move this down. And then I can pull this double over here. I feel like I'm gonna need both. Why would I have two lighty ones? 
if I only need one of them. I don't think this is going to be right, but now we can move this over and over, and then I can move this one up into the light. Is this a good one? Are you happy with this? I kind of love that this game explains nothing. Please be good. Oh, I think I have a different camera type. Yes! It wanted the lighty one. Oh, it just killed it. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, was that supposed to happen? What the frig? Okay, I think I'm on to something. So, this one I've never moved. This is the only four spot. It used to be up here. Now I have all this room for activities over here. Uh, I can get around the light one via the top. So, I have singlers here. But these are going to be need to get out of the way anyways. I, the biggest issue is these long horizontal ones. I think I figured it out. Holy crap. For a, for a starting puzzle, this is ridiculous. Uh, but I should be able to... Yes, I can fit it through here. And then I can just drag. Oh my god. Okay. So that is huge. I think I got it. Once I start moving these things all over here. Because what I have to do is bring this guy down to the bottom. I can't bring it to the top because there's no node right here. So, I think... I think I'm okay now. I just had to move the big square piece, which was the hardest part. Um, alright, yeah, we're actually good. We just gotta move these out of the way. Oh my god, I hate sliding puzzles so much. I am just not a puzzle person. <laughs> so, this was not easy for me. I'm sure it was simple for other people, but man, that was, uh... It was a lot of work, and I really hope I'm doing this right, because the last one just fell into the pits of hell. This one, I think, might do something else, because that was way harder to get over because it was connected to the extra piece. So please tell me this one doesn't fall, and something actually happens, because there's like a seat there or something. So we'll see what happens. Grab it. Yes. Is it good? Yes! Oh, there's like something hanging off of it. Oh my god, that's a human. That is definitely... Well, it's kind of a human. Yes, that's what I assume would, is what needed to happen. Now, I think we can finally move on. I did a puzzle. Go me. All right, goodbye, human thing. All right, and if you do remember, we need a helper for that door or something to hold the uh, lock in place. So I'm thinking that's kind of what I'm doing now is maybe making a human because there's a lot of machines that kind of point towards that. All right, so all that work, and where is it? Is that it? Oh, it's right there. It's dangling. So that's what this is for. So I'm thinking, ooh, it's making moaning noises. <laughs> is this this? Yes, this is the control for that. So now I can stab him or something? Use. Let's just try. There we go. Hey, buddy. Welcome to the club. It's, it's a great place. So what do I do? Drop him in the chair. Yes, drop him in the chair. If I use it again, it should... Perfect. <laughs> what the hell is this game? All right, I think I'm done there. So, what do we do now with you, buddy? I at least got you down here. I'm not so lonely anymore. All right, so I can move this. I knew this was like a rail system. And we can control this rail system, so let's put them on it. All right, I'll put you there for a second. This is obviously a machine. That I think I need to use? Hold on, let's let's see what this does, buddy. You're literally an experiment for me. Uh uh. Oh my god. Oh my god. What did I did I just torture him? I don't know what I solved there. He's just more angry. I'm so sorry. Alright, let's keep going here, man. Well, there's machines here for you, buddy. I don't know if you're going to like it or not, but we're here. All right, so I remember there's a crane on the roof with this. Yes, yeah, so I think we can pick him up. Here we go. Oh, you're, 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 you're going to love this. So I use this now, and hopefully it puts him in that seat. Let's just remember, I'm, I'm making a friend out of this, I think. So there you go. Now, I don't know what's going to happen to you from here, but we're going to find out together, my friend. Because I don't know what the hell this thing does, but let's find out. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my. Is he dead? Did I do it wrong? No, no, no. I need that, don't I? 
What the hell? I don't even know if I'm doing things right in this game. I mean, there's a new noise. I have to assume this is right. What the hell? What can I do with this now? I guess I don't need a friend all after all. All I need is a literal hand. So I don't remember which machine is which. I think this one opens it up. So we'll put the hand in there. Wait, no. I don't think we're done yet. I, I, I think we need two hands because... Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, this is good. No, it's not. <gasps> oh, this has got to be it. Yeah, this looks familiar. Oh, was, I've been looking around for so freaking long. That makes so much sense. So we use you over here because we only need one hand for this. And look at that. Now you're good, I think. Oh, wait. Stay in there, hand. Stay. Okay. <laughs> I love it. God, all that work for a hand. Man. Please work. Okay. I have advanced. So, that was obviously the first chamber done. And now we're on to uh, new puzzles. Does the scenery change? Yeah, it's definitely a little more gloomy in here. Oh, this is getting creepy. What? Oh, I hear something. Oh, I'm just waiting to be attacked by something. Ew. Oh my God. What is this place? All right, so we got some sort of big structure in the middle. It kind of looks brain-like. We have more rail systems. What's in here? Can I get in there? Oh yes, here it is. Okay, so I looked through here and I saw this. It's another one of those control things. What the hell? What am I doing now? Oh, this is exciting. Um, hello? Wait, what? What does that do? Hold on. If I use this... What is that? What even am I doing? Okay. Thanks, I think. Oh, now we can put it in there, maybe? Try that. Use. Uh, okay. Well, that popped up. I don't know what that means. Can I use this now? Yes, I can. Uh, this is new. I've given it life. Oh my god, Jesus. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. This whole game is just me confused. Well, I did something right, clearly. So, go me. And now that is unlocked. Am I free? Oh my god, this is so eerie. Oh, can I use this? No, I thought I could. Where am I now? <laughs> I can't even get out there. That's the thing. Ah! Oh my god! Oh, what the f... Oh my god, that scared me. What is... What is this? Oh. Oh, do I finally get a weapon? This looks weapon-like. Oh, oh, that's gross. Um, what the hell is this? Well, that's the most interesting. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Yep. This is definitely a weapon. What does it do? I do. I know you have to really conserve ammo in this game, so I don't want to use it yet. But we do have our first type of weapon. So I couldn't use this before. I can now. Oh, yeah. Stick it in there. Oh. And that's opening up from the area that was outside, I think. Or not. It just spawned... Or I hope those are friendly. Oh, my God. Oh, God. This scared me. Jesus. What is going on? What is that? Where's it going? <laughs> This whole game is just me questioning everything. <laughs> All right, so are these guys friendly? I mean, I do have a gun. Oh, that's not a gun. Okay. Uh, hello? What do you guys do? Can I get hit by this? Ah, nope, nope, can't get hit by that. Okay. Well, screw you, you little jerk. Oh my God, this actually works. Yes. Oh, I thought this would be a lot more useful. It just kind of punches, but I mean, it's better than nothing, I guess. So I have to kill all these things. Screw you! 
All right, we have another one of these. So one on each side of the corridor. Same idea as before? Yep. So we're opening this area up, it feels like. And also spawning our first enemies. I think the important part is wherever these things go, that's probably the next step because that seems to be a point of interest. All right, so we're just going to break these out of our way. Where did those go? All right, looking at this, it leads over here. Is this new? Oh, yeah, this is them. This is it. Okay, so this comes to here. Can I use this? Okay, I used this before. Is this what we need for this? Yes. Oh, sick. Okay, so I brought these things over. And I guess this goes into the... Ew. Oh, everything's so gross in this. All right, well, that one in... What about this one? Because that one's here too. Can I, can I, I can't use this again. So what do I do with you? Do you just chill here? Wait, is this new? That is not new. I think I, that's why I got my upgrade. This is new though. So we're powering it up, it feels like. Yeah, so it's doing the same thing again. And I think I got to do it one more time because I did this twice. Yeah, because I can use this again now. Perfect. So there's another slot somewhere. And that just popped up. So that's exciting. I think we also need to power it with this again. Seems like we have to do that every time. Never mind, I lied. Let's see what this does. So it's the same idea. I think every one of these power it up or whatever it's possibly doing. Oh, that's a, that's a new noise. Oh, oh, I think I just overloaded it. Oh God. Oh my. <laughs> Is it game over? Was I not supposed to do that? Oh God, we are in a new area, I think. Well, same area, but totally new style. I just died again. Or I'm going to pass out or something. What is that? Oh, this is gross. Oh. Oh, great. Well, we got overflowed with whatever that juice was. And now we're in a creepier spot. I... Is that me? Oh, yeah. Let's pull out of here. There we go. Am I outside for once? Well, I think I'm falling outside. Yep, there I go. This guy really has no good luck, does he? I think I was just born, essentially. I don't have my upgrades anymore, so this must be a new human. Because, yeah, that's clearly an umbilical cord. Yep. Or whatever it is in this universe. Let's uh, maybe pull that out so we can move. Oh, my God. Oh, God. <laughs> What a game, man. Ah, this looks like a nice, inviting place. All right, guys. Well, I think that's a good time to wrap up this episode here. We are clearly in a whole new area, and we are born again as a different human. Maybe the same human. I have no idea. This whole game is just eerie and a little confusing as well, but in a good way. So yeah, once again, I want to thank Scorn for sponsoring this episode. If you want to know anything more about this game, I'll have a link at the top of the video description. And yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, would you like to see more of this? Because yeah, I think there's going to be a lot more to do. And I have no idea where we're at right now. But yeah, if you guys would like to see more, maybe we'll do more in the near future. I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.